Hello and welcome to Cake Encryption. My name is Pete Gross and I'm an assistant professor here at Leeward Community College and I teach computer science. So let's go and learn about encryption. We're going to create a cipher wheel which is a cool tool that we can use to send secret messages and encrypt text. In order to create your cipher wheel you're going to need scissors, brass fasteners, and you're going to have to download the template at the URL below. Let's cut mine out and assembled it. So this is what it should look like when you're done. And you can see that, uh, you know, if you look at the inner disk, notice that it's not in alphabetical order. That's kind of a, you know, the letters are kind of random throughout it. So this makes it a little more challenging because you both need the same, you know, the person that you're going to share your message with, you need the same cipher wheel to be able to do this. So now let us learn how we can go about doing this and using it. Let us go and set our key up. And our key, what we're going to do is we're going to align the letter A on the outer disk with the letter G on the inner disk. Once you have that done, it should look like this. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our message, which is our plain text. And in this example, we're going to use ICS. And we're going to take this message and we're going to encrypt it using our cipher wheel. To do this, what we want to do is on the yellow wheel, which is our outer wheel, we want to find the letter I. And then we're going to write down the letter that lines up with this that appears on the red wheel. And then we want to do this for the next two letters, which are C and the letter S. Once you've encrypted it, you should get the letters Y, E, O. Now I'm going to issue you a challenge. So the key is on the large disk, a and on the small disk Q. So line them up and see if you can decrypt this text. So if you want a hint to be able to decrypt this, what you want to do is on the red disk, you want to find the letter. So you'd find the letter F and then you would find the corresponding letter that matches on the yellow disk and you would notice this is an L. And this is what you would do to decrypt the rest of this message. Hopefully when you decrypt it, you found that the encrypted text says Leeward. So I hope you've had fun and you've learned a little bit about encryption and how we can use it. And thanks. And please, uh, you know, make sure to check out other videos.